today we will look into imperfect of shamar it is very easy so firstly what you have to do is to write the shamar shamara without vowel from beginning to end so before that you had write uh, this is firstly third person masculine third person feminine then second person masculine second person feminine in this way and you return third person masculine third person feminine second person masculine second person feminine first person common here it is in the plural then you had write the root of shamar take out the vowel then write from beginning to end shamar sha ma ra you had write from beginning to end here so we now you have written shamar from beginning to end without vowel now this is imperfect imperfect is uh, it is a kind of incomplete action so it will be the feature in english so he will keep like the shamar means keep so imperfect means he will keep so in the imperfect we have two things we have written the first step is shamar from beginning to end without vowel then we need to add the suffix and prefix suffix we will add after prefix we will add before prefix before you will add we are fixing the some of the so in the imperfect we have prefix that is special to it so that prefix is e t t t a e t t t n that you are right e t t t a e t t t n so you are writing e t t t ye e t t t e t t n then in the second person feminine singular we have a suffix here so that is is uh, a e so you can write here shava then E N D E. In the plural, we have A U N A A U N A. That is from starting from um, start the beginning. U N A U N A. Or like that also you can write U. So you can give the stuff. I'm in Shiva here. U N A Shemar Ishmaru Tishmarana N A. Okay. Here in the sorry here a na na then again u e u here a na a na so now you e t t t a e t t t t n then suffix suffix you are adding that is in the second form is feminine e then a e is you are adding the shava here and e a e then applying the ending u that is shava here also a u a na a u a na uh, otherwise u a na u a na then uh, add the shava then add shava in the first letter shamor okay so like this come here then another specialty is the holam that will be in placed in the second letter above so wherever there is no vowel so you add vowel or shava they you add holam there so ishmo tishmo tishmo tish mary is a unit yes more then is is meru tish merana there is no vowel nothing is here tish tish morana not this one this is wrong and tish meru tish 
here also no vowel so add trish morana nish mor okay so i'll tell from beginning very easy three things in the imperfect shamar shamara right from beginning to end shamara then you apply the prefix e t e t t t a e t t t t ni forgot to write you no know, don't forget to write this uh, a dot inside it and then suffix um e a you write from beginning in order to be easily be to put the vowel a e here ke hot then in the plural section a u a is in the second letter a u a na a u a na and then apply the shava from beginning to end the third step first step ending suffix is the second step third step is putting the vowel in it so first letter is taking shava from beginning to end second letter is taking uh, holam holam you apply wherever there is no vowel is coming o sh ishmor tishmor tishmor um tish meru so the here no need tish meru ishmor and ish meru so no need to write the holam there ish meru tish merana tish meru tish merana nishmor meaning is he will keep she will keep you will thou will keep thou will thou will keep i will keep and then they will they will keep they will keep you will keep you will keep we will keep that is a feature imperfect you know imperfect that is in hebrew it is in a feature